how do you restore a relationship with a woman if she doesn't even want to talk? How do you get a girlfriend back if she doesn't want to see you? Does your girlfriend not want to see you? Do you continue to try to be your best, only to see her get mad at you, saying something like, Leave me alone. I don't ever want to see you again. You need to stop doing what you are doing, because it's obviously not working. In this video, I'd like to talk to you about how you can restore your relationship with a woman, even if she has gone completely cold and doesn't even want to talk to you. The first thing you need to do is give her time to calm down. If she says things like, I don't want to see you right now, I'm mad, go to hell, and you think that you should continue winning her over, bringing her flowers, and trying to convince her that everything will be different if she comes back, all you are doing is irritating her and making her even more mad. Imagine when you were a child, you did something bad and your parents found out. They, in turn, grounded you and haven't been in their best mood. But instead of laying low, so to say, you come up to your mother and demand that she buy you ice cream. What would happen? She would much more likely punish you than buy you anything. It's the same with your girlfriend. If she has negative feelings towards you and your relationship, any attempts on your part to get her back are doomed to fail especially if you are being needy while doing so. If you are begging her to come back, you are only pushing her further away. Acting in this way, you're only causing an uprising of negative emotions in her. Stop doing what definitely doesn't work. If you continue to follow your emotions, you'll only strengthen her negativity, making her more angry and solidifying her decision not to communicate with you you need to take a break. In most cases, this break should last for several weeks. I don't know the details of your specific case, but if you've been trying to talk to her for some time and she just closes off even more, you definitely need to stop bothering her and take a break from all communication. So, first thing you need to do is take a break. Second, figure out why she doesn't want to talk to you. Most likely, it has something to do with the way you acted. Your relationship likely had problems which you didn't want to see. Or maybe you just didn't understand what those problems were. Most men are babies in understanding what's going on in a relationship. They either don't see or don't want to see what's going on. It often happens that a girl has said 150 times that something needed to change that she felt hurt or neglected, or that she was depressed, and the man just replied, No, babe, everything is going great. A woman will wait for some time to see if anything changes, but then she'll say, We need to break up. I don't love you anymore. I don't want to be together. Most men will then try to use logic to convince her to stay. They say that everything will be all right, that things will change, as if logic can affect emotions. Here's an example. You're being hit on by a woman that weighs 300 pounds. You tell her that you are not interested, but she tries to use logic to convince you that you two should be together. Maybe she has a penthouse in Manhattan or a house in Bel Air. She may say, I'm a great choice. Just think about it. I have a penthouse and a private jet. Not many men will fall for that because they don't feel attracted to the woman. Maybe they are attracted to another woman who is happy and positive. They want to be with that woman without any conditions such as penthouses and jets. It's the same in your situation. If a woman doesn't feel the attraction that she used to, it means that it was lost somewhere. Most of the time, it has to do with the way the man in the relationship behaves, but it could also be due to your appearance, especially if you have changed a lot since you and your girlfriend first met. But the latter is unlikely. 90% of the time, men fail to understand how they should act in the relationship, turning into the male embodiment of the example I talked about earlier. 
Maybe you don't weigh 300 pounds, but you do have a similar effect on her because of how you behave. If you continue to be pitiful, showing her how needy you are, you are losing your leadership points, compelling the woman to reject you even further. Another thing to remember is that after the breakup, the woman will put up a defense wall to protect herself from being hurt by you. Let's talk about that. What is this defense? This is her reaction designed to protect herself from pain and disappointment that she felt while being with you. She understands that if she comes back, she will be hurt again, and she wants to avoid that. When you are trying to get her back by saying, please come back, she hears, I'll be hurt again. The more you are trying to get her emotionally into the same situation, the worse she feels, the more she wants to run away. This is the reason she doesn't want to talk to you. Understand that this defense mechanism is just a wall that is protecting her from the pain. You need to show her a better, improved version of yourself. You need to create an expectation and possibility of a much happier relationship. It's important to make her be attracted to you and value you again. How do you do this? You need to create your new attractive image, which will make her feel positive emotions and will draw her to you. Then you can influence her through indirect techniques. If you come to her directly and say, I've changed, I'm better, please come back, she will not believe you. What you need to do is use social media, mutual friends, or short messages to make her believe that you changed without actually saying so. You can discover how to do this by following the link below. After you've done this, it's very likely that she'll be drawn to you again. She'll want you to be her man once more but she still may have some doubts and fears. You could use pleasant memories of the times you've spent together to get her to forget her doubts and win her back faster. But remember that you really actually need to change for the better and create a foundation for a new, happy relationship. If you don't do this and lie to her, you will only get her back for a short period of time. If you lie, she will figure you out and leave you forever. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments section and I'll be happy to answer them. You can find more information on how to get her back, work on yourself, and prepare your relationship for happiness ever after in my book, Get Your Girlfriend Back. More information on this under this video. Like and follow my channel. Your support will help me create additional videos, helping more and more people.